Hi guys, welcome back to my life as a babe. So, uh, the season is almost over and uh, it feels, I don't, I don't know how I feel about it. It's so weird. Like I feel like I've only been in the babes for a month or something and it ends in two weeks and then that's it. Well, they start again in January, but um, because I'm traveling, I wanna start traveling in March. Um, I wouldn't be able to do the whole program because I think that conflicts with their show days. Um, and then I won't be here in the summer. So if they have one for the summer, I won't be able to do it. So basically I wouldn't be able to do, to do it again until this time next year. And it's just all gone by so fast. And I was thinking about it the other day and I'm so freaking grateful to have had this opportunity to like immerse myself in the thing that I love the most because I'm not in school and because now that I'm paying for dance, it means that I don't have limitations on how many classes I can take. Well, obviously like financially I have limitations. I can only afford so many dance classes, but um, before my parents would pay for dance and if they didn't want to pay more for classes, I couldn't take any more classes. But now it's kind of up to me as to how I spend my money um, with dance classes. And it's just been so nice to do what I love for so many hours of the week. Like I dance nine hours a week and some people, when I tell people that sometimes they're like blown away because technically that's like nine hours of cardio a week, like more than an hour for every day of the week. But it's, you think it'd be tiring, but it's not tiring when you love it, you know? Obviously I get tired at the, like during rehearsals and sometimes I wanna sit down and like take a break but it's not to the point where it's like, this is exhausting, I don't wanna do this anymore. Like if you really love it, then it, it doesn't matter, like, it doesn't matter how, how much energy it takes out of you because I feel so satisfied at the end of the day. Like, yes, everything hurts and, and I wanna go to bed sometimes or sometimes I'm really exhausted and I have like a headache and, But when I watch videos of myself like doing it or even seeing myself in the mirror doing the choreography and like sometimes I watch myself and I'm like, oh my gosh, I'm killing it. Like, who is that girl? That's, is that me? Who's <laughs> doing, like a year ago, I wouldn't have been able to dance like that. But because I have like immersed myself in all these different types of programs and I'm training so often, I've progressed so much and it's so satisfying to see. And I'm just so grateful to have had this opportunity to dance with the babes and to be in all my different programs because I, I got a chance to really see like what it's like to be doing what you love all the time. And I think that'll help me when I'm like in, cause I'm gonna start, I have to start applying for university soon. So I think that's gonna help me decide things like what programs I wanna go into. Um, because this experience has taught me like, you know, if you love something, even if you do it for multiple hours a week, it's not draining. You'd think that nine hours of dance a week would be draining, but it's not. It gives me so much energy. Literally sometimes after I go and dance for the entire day and I'm like sweating and everything hurts, I go home and I dance more. Like not even to practice choreography, just for fun. I just put on music and dance because it, it gives me energy. Like in rehearsals, I may be like, so tired and like want to sleep but then i get home and i'm like ooh, like I'm, I'm energized again which is so weird because you'd think i would have used all the energy in rehearsal but that's 
that's like kind of that shows me that like in a career when I'm figuring out what I want to do with my life like that's the type of career I should do you know something that I don't feel that doesn't drain me at the end of the day something that energizes me even if I have to do it for multiple hours a week um, so yeah this is just it's been a crazy ride but I'm so happy that I did it all and even on the days where I didn't want to go or I was really tired I still went and I think it's gonna be so satisfying to perform on that stage and just see like the audience's reaction to everything and like talk to my friends after the show and to have them be like oh my gosh that was crazy Helen I didn't know you could dance like that because a lot of my friends haven't seen me dance before because I've only ever done like re like recitals right so obviously like you don't want to go to a recital it's kind of boring but these shows are really entertaining to watch right so to have my friends come and like see that and see what I'm capable of and then tell me after like oh my gosh what I didn't know you could do that like I don't know I'm just I'm so happy like for everything that I took out of this season with the babes, out of my whole experience being in different dance programs. And yeah, I don't know, it's taught me a lot. And I'm just so grateful for like literally every single uh, dance opportunity that I've had and all the people. So like I'm thankful for like Chelsea and Danny and I'm thankful, thankful for the directors of my other dance programs for like trusting in me and like I literally <laughs> messaged the babes the other day like the Instagram account and I was like I just want to say thank you for everything because like I came into this program looking for growth and that's exactly what I got and you guys continue to push me and continue to challenge me and it's true like it wasn't easy like if you want to go into this program, I'm not going to tell you that it's easy. But that's also, you shouldn't go into life looking for things that are easy. I like to be challenged and I hate being in dance classes where like I'm above everyone else's level because it's like a waste of my time, right? If I'm not challenged, then I'm not learning anything new. But with this, it was hard. Like they they pushed me every single week and that made me a better dancer and like made me pick up quicker and made me become more versatile in different styles and it just, I don't know, I'm so happy. This has just, it's been such a nice experience to do what I love. Um, finally for like as many hours as I want so thank you Chelsea and Danny for everything I could not be more grateful to you and everyone else all the other dance influences in my life so yeah thanks this has been a well it's not the end yet but the end is coming near so this has been a great like wild ride but thanks for coming with me on it i'll see you guys next week bye i know when you i can't try